what's up it's grace and today i thought that i would do something super cool and not like usual i have been scrolling through instagram and i have been looking at everybody's makeup looks and hair and i just dyed my hair so i've been wanting to play around with it and i thought that i would make myself look like kendall jenner yay so yeah i'm going to show you how i do my hair and makeup so keep watching to see that and i will see you on the other side guys so we are going to start with some poreless face primer this is elf i got it from target and where does it go well i've actually never used primer fun fact because i'm old and behind on the trends so i ha i went and bought a bunch of new makeup for this and because i needed it and so i got this too and wow it feels interesting I know you probably shouldn't use your hands for this because it's oily, but bear with me. I'm doing my best here, okay? Yay! So, Kendall wears really, really basic, natural makeup. She really only focuses on her, the darkness of her brows, which I'm pretty sure that she just keeps them that dark because her hair's that dark, so maybe they're tattooed on or I don't know. Sometimes she'll throw in a red lip. Sometimes her eyelashes will be longer. I don't know. Sometimes she gets extensions. I don't know. Doing my research, that's what I got. So I am going to be basing my look today off of these three pictures, but mainly this one. So, yes. So I'm also going to add freckles because she has the cutest freckles. I think I'm going to use BB cream because she really, like, she really focuses on natural. Some days she doesn't even wear makeup. So we're just going to put on that BB cream today. And, I mean, my acne's not that bad, so let's go for it. Mason's sitting right here, so... If you hear someone laughing at me, it's probably him. I feel like, do people still wear BB cream? I feel like people went on to wearing CC cream and then they just went on to full-fledged foundation back to that trend. So, I don't know. I really like BB cream in, like, the summer. I actually don't really wear foundation that much at all. So, you know, but in the winter, I if I have to wear it, I usually do wear, like, full foundation because... It keeps your skin warm and it breaks the cold from hitting it, so. Protective, yay. Oh yeah, this is the brush I'm using, if you couldn't tell. It's like made for foundation, I think, I hope so. Not a beauty guru, just trying to make myself look like Kendall Jenner, cause you know, I guess looking like Grace Tory didn't work anymore. <laughs> I'm still sick, update on my life, still sick. So that's cool. Maybe one day I won't be. Um. Boo boo boo. <laughs> yep. Nothing too fancy here. Just putting on some BB cream. And if you have any problem spots, I guess you could put concealer on those. Yeah, I have problem spots, so I definitely will. <laughs> so give me a second. And we'll get to that. Uh, we'll conceal. Conceal, don't feel. Is that it? Is that how it goes? Yeah. It's my motto. Conceal, don't feel. <laughs> I don't know anybody else who has that motto. I totally made it up myself. Now we're going to do our under eyes. Do our no nose a little glow. That's how I prime my eyeshadow. Fun fact, just use concealer. Saves so much time. Um... And get all of our problem areas. I think that's all I have. I look like a clown. This is good. This is good. And we're done. I'm kidding. <laughs> I keep wanting to say Kylie Jenner because. Ooh. I need to turn that off. Because, um. I don't know. I've always identified with Kylie Jenner more. But my sister looks more like Kylie. And I look more like Kendall. Um. So I've always been the Kendall to her Kylie. So I don't know. I just, I follow Kylie more, but I love Kendall. She's honestly the cutest, prettiest thing, and I want to be here when I grow up. Yeah! So, next, she has a very bronzed, glowy face. But it's funny because down here is not, like, it's just, like, from here where she has, like, stuff on and up. But I'm actually going to do my eyes first. And I bought this new palette from Target. 
and I was obsessed when I saw it, so I had to get it. It's called Paradise Enchanted Scented Eyeshadow. It's a scented, ladies. And my other, the Chocolate Factory, which was what I usually use in my other videos, it smells like chocolate, so I was like, yeah. I don't know what this smells like because I'm still sick, but we're going to go with it. We're going to take this, this color, the lightest one. We're going to prime, is that what it's called? I love this. Um, and now I'm gonna take this color. It's like a almost a beigey tan. We're gonna go in the crease. I'm trying to like talk and do this, and it's not working out too well. So we're gonna take our concealer and go in and fix it in a hot sec. Oh my gosh, this eyeshadow goes on so quick. Like I could barely touch like my face with it and it would be on all the way that's a lot i'm gonna take uh, probably this one it's like a sparkly and go on here mm -mm. and then i think i'm gonna go back in and just do the crease again with the same color because she keeps it pretty natural, so I don't want to put, like, a ton on. Now I'm just going to take my blender thing that still has stuff on it, and I'm going to go on the sides and right under my eyebrow. And I'm going to go back in and blend, blend, blend. So that's eyeshadow, and I think that we're going to take some white eyeliner and do our under eyes, because her eyes always look good and she always gets the good amount of sleep I feel like or she at least looks like she does probably because she uses white eyeshadow so we're just going into her eyes and then for the fun part let's see if I can do this I'm not going to do this on camera because I freaking suck whoa there's three pairs in here I thought there was only one. But I'm going to put these on and I will see you in a hot second BRB update. When I was at the store, I forgot to get eyelash glue because I'm a dummy. And I can't find mine. So we're just going to do eye mascara now. And just going to make it really big. <laughs> but she also doesn't wear them sometimes. So I feel like it could go either way. I was just going to do it because I wanted to wear them, honestly. And she does wear them sometimes. So... Either way, we're still looking like a Jenner. Oh, I'm also using a pumped up colossal mascara. I think I use this in every single video, so. Yay, drugstore products. And the eyeshadow that I showed you guys, the palette that I bought, that's also L'Oreal. Um, so if you don't know and you want to buy it because it's literally gorgeous, L'Oreal at Target. My ear's itchy. Why is my ear itchy? Why did I? Oh, no. Mascara on my face. Mascara on my face. Mascara on my face. Get off the roof. Get off the roof. Get off the roof. Do you know what that's from? <laughs> it's from Mulan. Yay. So mascara's done. Wow, I look like a whole new person. Oh, this is where things get a little dicey because we got to make our face look like Kendall, sort of. And uh, she has a way thinner face than I do. But swag, you'll look. We're just gonna roll with it. So I'm gonna take my little bronze and brush. I'm not gonna contour because again, her like her makeup's so natural. Should I put freckles on, Mace? If you want. No, answer me. If you wanna look like her with freckles on. Do you? Should I put freckles on? Oh, by the way, I'm just using my uh, Too Faced bronzer in the shade Sun Bunny. I think it's like the only one they make, honestly. It was when I bought it. You should see what it looks like without it and then maybe put it on. No, because I have to put it on before I put on like blush. Oh. Uh, no, I wouldn't think so. Okay, then I won't. I mean, it looks good either way. Okay, so no freckles today, guys. If you want me to do a 
um, video on how I put fake freckles on. I had them on in my senior pictures. Here, I'll post, I'll put a picture right there. Um, I can do that for you guys. I used to wear them almost every day, and then I just decided not to, so here we are. That was a lot of bronzing. I just, I'm not near as tan as she is, and I wanted to look as tan as she is, so here we are. Then I'm gonna take Becca highlighter. I feel like everyone has the same exact one. And it looks like that. I'm gonna be taking the blush because it's super corally and pretty. And I'm using my bronzing brush because my blush brush has red blush all over it from it being winter. Honestly, I look better as Kendall than I do as Grace. I might start wearing this every day. Okay, now, does she have highlighter on in this picture? Yes, she does. So, we're going to take my little highlight and brush. And we're going to go in with Becca. She doesn't have a lot on. She just has a tiny bit on. So, we're just going to do our nose. Tiny bit on her cheeks. And then for lip. So, Mason got me Burt's Bees Kissable Color. Um like lip gloss almost it's kind of like if it's good I don't know but it uh it's really nice like I highly recommend this it's literally the best um or you can get me a apricot either one so uh, this is apricot and I'll show you oh my gosh I love it which one should I wear apricot or grapefruit I mm, hold on apricot because it looks like lip gloss, but it's chapstick. Like, most amazing thing invented. And it kind of mixes with your natural color to, like, make it, like, I don't know. I just really like it, and I think that you should try it, too. Because we're just girls helping girls, and maybe some guys helping guys around here. Last but not least, eyebrows. Her eyebrows are like black, but my hair is not black, so I don't want to do black eyebrows. So, I'm going to do this one like I usually do with my little brush, and I'm just going to brush it into my eyebrow. Hers looks so natural. That's how I think that, like, they're either dyed or, like, she, because she doesn't color them in. I don't know. I just realized Pumpkin's been crying in the background this whole time um pumpkin's sad because she doesn't want to be in here alone but she doesn't want to be out there so we just decided to put her out there with the other dogs um and she's not too fond of it so maybe i'll reduce the background noise but i don't like the way my voice sounds when i reduce the background noise so i apologize if i do that my voice sounds kind of weird I'm doing my best with what i have these eyebrows are not super Kendall, but they're super Grace because I don't have black hair. And this is what we got. Is Pumpkin here? <gasps> Look who came to see me. Look who came to see me. Look who came to see me. This is Sweet Pumpkin. Oh, Sweet Pumpkin. You guys have seen Pumpkin like a hundred times, but she's just as cute as she was the first time, so. Now I'm taking my little spoolie. I think it's called a spoolie. I don't know. And I'm just brushing it out so that it looks more natural because, again, she is very, very, very natural. So there, we're finally finished with the makeup. For natural makeup, that took a hot minute. Next is hair. So the, this is the thing. I was going to wear it straight like this because this is like her signature hair. Like super straight. Like as straight as you can possibly get it. And then like parted down the middle. But then I decided I look like Lord Farquaad, so we're going to have to do something a little different. I don't know how I'm going to do it, because, like, this is literally how she wears her hair. So, I don't want to look like Lord Farquaad. She slicks it back a lot, like, she'll... Kind of close. Um, I think, since I don't slick it back because I'm not going to the freaking Emmys, um... I think I'm just going to do it half up, um, 
pull this down. Yeah, because this is like my equivalent of wearing it parted down the middle. Now Harley's howling. Okay. There we go. So next I need to figure out what outfit I'm going to wear. So BRB, next time you see me, I will be dressed and ready to go. Hey guys, so this is what I ended up wearing. Um, it's just, I'm going to move this. It's a plain white shirt because she wears a lot of like baggy, super casual stuff when she's not like, you know, in fashion week. Mason's over there talking to Evie. Um, so I just wear a plain white shirt and then this um, flannel, but it has a skull on the back. Um, and then I wore some black jeans with my booties um, that I love, and the jeans are ripped, so yay, yay. And that's my finished outfit. Hey guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Comment who which person I should try and look like next, and I will see you guys in my next video. Like and subscribe if you want to. It would really help out my channel. That sounded weird. Really, really. And if you want to see what I'm doing between uploads, check out my social media. It's in the description below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Love you. So I heard, I found somebody else.